little rain out there. Yeah. Is it going to be soggy out here? Uh, we have the chance of getting a couple of showers here in the metro later on this evening. We'll have to keep a close eye on that. Meanwhile, taking a look at Cloudcroft, the skies have certainly been dark throughout much of the afternoon, but so far, no showers over Cloudcroft putting a damper on any plans, so good news there as we take a look at downtown Albuquerque. You can see a few of those clouds starting to bubble up over the Sandias, mostly clear over the valley floor, but we are starting to see a lot of convection over the Sandias right now. We're also seeing that convection over the northern mountains as well, so we're going to have to keep a close eye on the storms that develop because much like the last couple of nights, we could see a couple of gust fronts collide, and if, they ha if that has happens to happen over the city, we could get a shower or storm going here later on. We'll have to keep an eye on that in the meantime, 84 degrees, the current temperature in the metro right now across the north, looking at the 70s and 80s, 82 in Santa Fe, 82 also for Taos, 74 in Los Alamos, 91 in Farmington, down to the south in the 80s and 90s here, 93 in Roswell, 94 in Carlsbad, 93 currently in Alamogordo. We do have quite a few showers going, especially over the higher terrain. We've got the showers popping up over the northern mountains into the San Juans of Colorado. Down to the south, we're looking at the Sacramento Mountains for a few of those showers and a few of those showers also developing along the west central mountains and into the Gila as well. So we have showers surrounding the Albuquerque metro area, so we'll have to keep an eye on what develops over the city throughout the evening hours. Taking a wider look at the setup, we have high pressure still sitting over the four corners. So what storms that have developed this afternoon have been very slow movers and that does lead to the potential for some flash flooding. We've seen a little bit of that in the Gila through the afternoon hours and we'll continue to watch for some of that over the northern mountains later on tonight. We'll continue with some of those scattered storms up until about midnight and then we'll start to see some of that activity back off. Tomorrow, tomorrow a few more scattered showers and storms as we start to recycle moisture, but the storm coverage will decrease over the next couple of days to where we're only looking at spot storms, mainly over the higher terrain across the north and west by Sunday. But then into early next week, we start to get that high pressure to move out to the east. That'll open up the moisture tap once again across the west and we'll get a resurgence of moisture across the western and central portions of the state through the beginning and middle parts of next week. And this is really more of our traditional monsoon setup. So it does look like we're going to stay into a pretty good pattern. It looks like we'll stay wet at least through the end of next week. Southern Colorado highs tomorrow into the low to mid 80s with some storms around, especially over the higher terrain. We back those storm chances off into the beginning of next week before seeing those storm chances go back up toward the end of next week. Over the northwest, mix of sun and clouds, afternoon showers and storms, highs into the 80s. We'll be in the low 90s by Sunday and Monday with a little less moisture, and then we start to resurge that moisture through Tuesday and Wednesday. Over the southwest, scattered afternoon showers and storms, highs into the 80s and 90s. We'll keep a good chance of going through scattered showers and storms through the weekend, especially over the Gila and into next week as we start to see more of that moisture move in. Over the southeast, partly cloudy skies, highs into the low 90s for several locations tomorrow. More sunshine for the end of the weekend and early next week we'll be looking at storm chances returning by the end of next week over the northeast partly cloudy skies scattered afternoon showers and storms with highs into the upper 80s to low 90s more shower chances through sunday spot storm chances through monday and tuesday over the northern mountains afternoon storms possible highs in the 70s and 80s we'll continue to watch for good chances of showers and storms especially by the time we reach next week over the east mountains scattered afternoon showers and storms a possibility once again highs in the mid 80s in the metro low 90s for tomorrow spot storm chances not that we couldn't see a storm but chances are less and less through saturday and sunday before we see more of that moisture return especially by tuesday and wednesday